Well, I have the, I have a a problem with that whole definition of drama as conflict. I think that particular word conflict has sent us off often in in false wrong directions just because it's you know, it's like this patriarchal military word. When I think that the act what it actually means and what we're actually going for what actually creates a scene is that tension that difference between one person and another where I you know I kn I know that I interpreted conflict for a long time as you know as arguing or you had a different a, a flat out difference with somebody when it can be actually a, a difference in subtext and you decide you know which world you want to inhabit and there's there's plenty of conflict but not in that classic that classic sense of where you got the cop buddy movie where you know they're always going into the captain and arguing with the captain and that's the conflict and, and well and then the guy is about to retire you know he's going to be dead soon yeah yeah exactly so you're saying that that well, you're you're more interested in the idea of two people have let's say two people have two conflicting realities well i think uh, it depends on what you're writing about. I mean, sometimes it, it calls for conflict. Sometimes it calls for a big arguing scene. But I'm interested in the play of tensions between people because I find often that, that I'm bored by the flat-out conflicts. 